WTFNN. Headline News Update. Good afternoon, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of still sunny Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 2 p.m. update. And currently have all the U.S. indices, all the sectors with inside the S&P 500 trading to the upside. The Dow is up about 7 tenths of a percent, 228 points. One and a quarter percent for the S&P, 54 points. One and nine tenths for the NASDAQ 100, a 282 point move there. One and a half percent for the Russell, 26 points. Two and seven tenths for the semis. That's a 94 point move. One percent for the trannies, 150. Gold is up 18 bucks, nearly 1%, a little over 2% for silver. That's 51 pennies. Lights we crude trade now at 81.20, up a dollar 10, one and three tenths percent. Natural gas back three pennies in the 30 year treasury, up one full point and seven ticks. Trade now at 121.05. Let's take a look at what all that means by looking at that nine panel market update chart. We begin with the ES mini upper left hand side. What do we know? Well, we know that one of the resistance levels is where price is likely headed to. That first resistance level is going to be be the top of its daily profile 4506 is what i would call it if you see it close above that odds favor a move back to its high it's roads victim indicator top at the 46 21 75 level now spot volatilics is below its 50-day exponential moving average close below it yesterday below it today odds would favor that this is going to go target its lower bollinger band that's at the 1340 area if it does that the spot volatilics we will see the es mini take out that resistance level the nq right now is trading above the top of its daily profile doesn't matter what it's doing at 201 matters what it's doing at five o'clock this evening, does price close above uh, the top of that profile at 15,359? If it does, that suggests move to 16,062. US dollar index is attempting to form a new daily profile. That new daily profile is bearish and structured. Now, I won't have a confirmation on this profile until later on this evening. Uh, we, the U.S. dollar index has tried forming new daily profiles for the last several days out there. Right now, support is at 10307. If this profile goes away, the number to be watching, because I'll be gone for the next couple weeks, the number to be watching on the U.S. dollar index would be 10298. A counter trend move. So if this new profile doesn't form, then it's the old profile. And so a counter trend move to the downside in the U.S. dollar would find support at that 102.98 level. So it's either 102.98 or 103.07. Gold trading above resistance, the top of its profile at 1953. Silver looks like it wants to get back to its highs from back in the uh, July time frame. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader Z Show. But if you have to start your day, have a terrific one. We'll look forward to speaking with you again soon. The reality.